How not to lose a race, meet the finger skater. It's disgraceful. He's a Dutch skater whose team lost a championship relay race to the Russians. Pretty sad. That's the Russian in blue making the we're number one gesture, while Dutch skater Shinghi Kanet makes a double-barreled, single-finger salute. <laughs> He's whipping him up. That's yeah. something I would do. You would? <laughs> no. <laughs> and as if that weren't enough... First the upraised middle fingers, then a pretend kick. It's very unsportsmanlike. You know, I'm a sportsman, I wouldn't do that. If I lost, I'd shake a man's hand, I'd say congratulations, I hope you do very well. You know? But I'd be, He's I'd shaking be... his finger. And here we thought the Dutch tradition was for a little boy to stick his finger in a dike to stop the leak, not raise two fingers at a competitor. Is he sorry? Of course I regret it. It happens out of emotion and not actually conviction. It just sucks. Skating officials disqualified Kanet for his behavior, but that won't prevent him from facing his Russian rival next at the Olympics in Sochi. Netherlands Broadcasting played old video of the skater, saying he has a history of losing his temper. Kanet had at least one New York defender. It's the spirit of competition. I can understand the guy throwing the fingers. This guy has thrown fingers of his own. A cab was trying to cut me off. Some are making comparisons. Sports Grid joked, Shing He Kanet is Dutch for Richard Sherman. Don't you ever talk about me! Sore winners, sore losers. When's the last time you flipped someone off for what? I might be you because you keep me here in the snow. <laughs> Genimo, CNN, New York.